really love it right now. Are you guys hungry? Yes, I'm so hungry. Yeah. Why don't we go to eat something? Hmm, let me think. How about going to Linky Kitchen? Yeah. That's so great. I hear that Linky Kitchen has a lot of delicious food. Let's go. Let's, Let's go. go. Yeah. Hello, everyone. My name is Wenan. My name is Ting Nao. My name is Ngoc Khan. And we are a student from Sunglin uh, High School. Today we have a short interview about what foreigners think about our traditional food. Let's go with us and find the answer. Let's go. How do you rate it on a scale 1 of 10? Uh, ah, okay. Um, 9. 9. Yes. yes. yes yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Yes. Yeah. Have a good trip. Thank you. Yes. Uh, can I ask your name? Yes. Uh, Ka. K-A. K-A. Ka. Ka. Okay. Um, where are you from? Hong Kong. Okay. And um, how long have you been in Vietnam? I think it's uh, 12. Yeah, well, okay. Okay. What Vietnamese is that you find strange or unique? Strange. Yeah. Unique. Uh, I just try the red. I just try the few red. Ah. The reds. Ah. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> the mouse. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's tasty. Uh, yeah. And um, have you ever tried any traditional food in Vietnam? Uh, yes. Uh, actually, Hong Kong has quite a lot of uh, Vietnamese. Yeah. Uh, what's kind of food? Uh, like uh, the rice roll. Yeah. Ah. And the noodle, rice yeah. noodle. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Fur. Ah, There's yeah. quite a lot in Hong Kong. Oh, okay. And um, so today we're gonna introduce for you a uh, secret dishes. Um, this is not uncommon for local residents, but also a visitor. Can you guess the name of this food? Uh, the rice roll, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, can you try them? Yes. It's good. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Um, what is your first impression of this food? Uh, we have similar things in Hong Kong, but the taste is a little bit different. Yeah, okay. Um, can you guess? Can you guess the ingredient in this food? Yes, um, shrimp, yeah, uh, vegetable, yeah, and some, some. I don't know how to call it, but it's quite strong. Uh, uh, the taste of some kind of vegetables. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's quite. The taste is quite strong, but yeah, I don't yeah. know how to call that. Okay, um, that's right, yes, sir. So, after a spring run, um, how do you grade it on a scale of 10? Uh, 9? Oh, I think. Yeah, we have a small gift for you. Here a gift. Thank you. Thank you. you. Like my soul. <laughs> this is a cake chain. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Have you ever tried any traditional food in Vietnam? Yes. Uh, what do you, okay, what uh, for me, uh, the, 
bún chai yeah, bún chà. Uh, and a lot of other things. I don't know the names. Uh, okay, okay, I, I, okay, yeah. okay. So um, uh, today we're gonna introduce for you a, a special drink in Vietnam that we call this in Vietnamese coffee, and you can try it. Really good. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. nice. Uh, so, and I want to introduce for you that uh, Vietnamese coffees were introduced by the French in the 19th century. And uh, because we use the bean filter to make coffees, so many you, when you first, when you first try that, you can feel that it's really strong. Right? Yeah, but I love strong. <laughs> I, yes, I love okay. strong. <laughs> and uh, that's all. And before the end, we have a for you. This is about the coffee that uh, Emma you remind you when you travel in anywhere. So thank you so much. Oh, no, yeah. thank you so much. Come yeah. on. Yeah. Well, after interview three foreigners, we can see that they love Vietnamese food because it's fresh, simple, and tasty flavors. People enjoy the balance of sweet, sour, salty, and spicy taste. And they also like how the food feels healthy. So. We think that street food is a big part of the experience, showing visitors real local life. Hmm, well, you know what? Because of that reason, we can confidently say Vietnamese food is known for being delicious, diverse, and affordable rice, making it a favorite for travelers. Finally, we so appreciate that you can enjoy this video with us, and thanks for watching.